Hello guys and welcome to another tutorial video. In this short tutorial video, I'll be showing you how to swap USDT to Solana in Trust Wallet. So how can you go about this? The search icon at the top of the screen, use it to search for the USDT token. Now you can simply go ahead and select any USDT token you have on this list. So go ahead and click on a USDT token, which has its network there as well. So for this tutorial video, I'll be going with the USDT on the Ethereum network. So all you need to do is simply click on Ethereum. All right, so once you've selected Ethereum USDT, all you need to do to swap this USDT into the Solana token is by clicking on the swap icon. And all you need to do now is note a couple of things. In order to swap from USDT to Ethereum, you must have Ethereum to cover your gas fees. That is, you must have some local Ethereum to cover your gas fees for a native swap which is the same way you want to do a cross-chain swap. A cross-chain swap is when you move from one network to another, where you move or convert your tokens from one network to another, just as we are moving from the Ethereum to the Solana. So now if you were to enter the amount of USDT you wish to convert into Ethereum, you would have to pay only your native gas fees because it is a native swap in the network. It's a net, it's a swap inside of the Ethereum network. But anything outside of the Ethereum network is a cross-chain swap. To do this, to do the cross-chain swap, click on the network toggle at the bottom of the screen and then select the Solana network. So once you've selected Solana, you can easily convert your USDT Ethereum into the Solana token by paying the cross-chain bridge fees. So there are fees attached to cross-chain swaps. As I mentioned earlier, there are fees attached to this, which are higher than the local gas fee you would pay. So let's say for 100 USDT on the Ethereum blockchain, in order to swap it into Solana, you, you must also have your native token available, which is the Ethereum, to cover the fees that you would inquire to swap. And you would also need some extra gas fees to move this token from this Ethereum network to the Solana network. So guys, comment down below if you have a question and you'll be given an answer. Thank you.